Hey guys, HDV here, and welcome back to the Pokemon Sacred Gold Egglock. If you guys are enjoying the series, you know what to do. Just drop a like down below because it really does help out the video, the series channel, all that good stuff. And I really, really do appreciate it. And it also shows me that you guys are enjoying the series. I know that you guys are enjoying the series because I get a lot of positive feedback on this series. But you know, when you hit that like button down below, it just it just kind of solidifies it, you know. Also, make sure you're answering that comment question today as well to have a Pokemon named after you. In the last episode, we did the Team Rocket Hideout. We actually shiny Magic Arch and Magic Karch. Magic Karch and a shiny Larvitar. In this episode, we're taking on Price. We got everyone up to level 42 because his levels are between 42 and 44. So I thought, hey, get everyone up to 42. It'll be a good day at the office. I have no idea how I'm going to beat this gym though because he's got Ice-type Pokemon. And the only thing that I really have for Ice-type Pokemon is Lucario. But I'm pretty sure one of those Ice-type Pokemon are going to be rocking Earthquake, which I'm not looking forward to at all. But let's just take on this gym real quick. Boom, boom, boom. That was easy. That was very easy. Right. I feel like I'm going to take on all the trainers, though, just in case. Um, because I just, I, I feel like I need to, you know? I need to get that XP. A seal. Are you even a nice type? I don't feel like you are. Are you? Right, it's Force Palm. You're not even a nice type. That's a banded Force Palm, though, with the power. Oh, you've gone underwater. Great. Well, I mean, just gonna... I don't know. That was annoying. Boom, you're dead. Delibird. Like... You're not even ice. I mean, I know you are, but you're flying as well, so why... Why are you living on one? Why are you doing that to me? Boom, level 42. Alright. It's about this dude as well. What do you got? You're gonna have a nice type that actually is weak to fighting, because none of those guys were. Alright? Just saying. How are you gliding in the air like that with your board? That's really crazy. Swine up. There we go. Oh, he's going to have a mammoth swine, isn't he? I mean, that's not too bad. Because I have... Hmm. I think I'll be okay with a mammoth swine. I should be. Boom. Force palm. A smooch him. You're ice and psychic, but this should still kill. Yeah, you're dead. And a snow run. These are not very good Pokemon. At all. Let me go heal real quick. Lucario, you're absolutely crushing this gym, pal. Just want to give credit where it's due, you know? <clears throat> I mean, I've got a band of close combat that I can fire off. Obviously, if it doesn't kill anything, then it's going to absolutely destroy me. I'm not looking forward to fighting that Mummaswine, though. Not even the slightest. Because Earthquake is not something I want to be dealing with at all. Like, here's me. Here's Earthquake. I want to stay as far away from this Earthquake as I possibly can. Because nobody wants to deal with Earthquake. Not one person wants to deal with Earthquake. I'll tell you right now. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Right, what we got to do here? Uh, it's that, isn't it? This is very easy. Alright, I feel like i got to battle you. I feel like i got to battle all these people. Go up there. No, I can't go. Uh, oh no, I have smashed it, and then I go up there. Okay, so I probably won't battle the other two gym trainers because I've already, I basically already can get to the gym leader from here. Just got to battle this guy. A Sanizal. Dark and ice. Oh, you can have a Weaver, bro. This guy's team is gonna be broken as heck. My Weaver is not scary because obviously I have times four fighting time move on it. But it is going to outspeed me. And Weavile could easily have an, uh, like a fighting type move for my Lucario, which is not something I want to deal with. Just take the sneeze out real quick. It's going to absolutely body it because it's dark and ice. Times four weak to fighting. And a Celio. Celio! There we go. It's the Gen 3 games where Celio looks like he's really worried about something. He's like, shit! I'm never going to do that again. Can this kill? Thank you. Thank you. Come again. Right. Boom. So we've got level 44 Skeeter. All right. I'm not going to lead with Skeeter. Or I could, to be fair. This is going to be a difficult gym battle. 100%. Like, it ain't going to be easy at all. I'm running out of Force Palms as well. All right. Super Potion up. Boom. Didn't buy any Ice Heals. So I'm probably going to get frozen. I mean, I can definitely lead with Lil Hammy. I don't see why not. 
get off like an ancient power or something like that, get the boost and just sweep him. Pokemon have many experiences in their lives, just like we do. I too have seen and suffered much in my life. Since I am your elder, let me show you what I mean. I've been training Pokemon since before you were born. I do not lose easily. I, Price, the Winter Trainer, shall demonstrate my power. So in the manga, Price like wanted to kill like the main characters. Just if you didn't want it, if you didn't know that, now you do. That walking stick leads with an Abomas Snow, which is a Grass type. Not great at all. Um. Okay, that's not great. This man has an Abomas Snow. Um. I mean, Master learned Flamethrower, so I can definitely go into Master. I just hope he doesn't have... I, I, I hope he goes for a Grass type. Yeah, okay, 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 sweet. Perfect switch in. Resist it. Ice. Gonna hurt, but it's fine. Absolutely fine. Right, Flamethrower. This should kill. This gym music is so good, though. That was a crit. I don't. I don't think the crit mattered at all. Like it's a times four stab flame for bro. Like that is not gonna get survived. The hail is up though, and I feel like a bunch of these Pokemon are gonna have like Ice Body, or the one where they like become more like shrouded in the the ice and it's hard to miss. It's hard to hit them and stuff like that. Like I feel like that's gonna be the case. Level 43. Why? Why are you higher level than the Bomber Snow? Like, seriously. Oh, because you're going to have sheer cold, aren't you? Don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. Ooh, that's going to hurt. Bro, that hurt a lot. And he's not going to miss Blizzard as well because it's in. I think I Night Slash here. Right? Because there's obviously the chance I can miss Thunderfang. Okay. Blizzard is not something I want to deal with. What's your next mom going to be? I know you've got a Mammoth Swine. I don't know what your ace is. Your ace might be Mammoth Swine. There's the Mammoth Swine. Um, but I should be good. I got a little hammy. I should be good. Although this thing's probably going to have Fisher as well, isn't it? Which is most likely going to have Fisher. Is this your ace? Is this level 44? It is. This is your ace. Okay. Surf time. Earthquake should be fine. It shouldn't do too much. Did I resist it? No. But I'm bulky as heck what I thought I was. What did that do so much? Okay. What is your item? Is this like a banded mammoth wine or something? I did a lot of damage. I don't know what I can do here. Let's just switch into Charizard. But this thing has thick fat, doesn't it? This thing 110% has thick fat. So I don't even think a flamethrower will kill from it. He withdrew. Into Lapras? Why? Probably to take the surf, wasn't it? Um, I don't really know what to do here. I, I kind of want to go into Skeeter, but... I'm going to go into Skeeter. I'm going to risk it. Because at least if it does have Shake Hold, it can't kill my Skeeter. Because I'm a level higher than it. Blizzard. I mean, I resist it. Don't do too much. It's stab, though. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Don't freeze. Okay, hail is a thing though. Right, I don't want to risk the close combat. I just want to force palm. So I think close combat will not kill. Let's see how much force palm does. Close combat would have killed. Close combat would have easily killed. You stayed in, so what do you have? Okay, that's fine. Person is absolutely fine. They're still falling. 
I don't think this hail is going anytime soon. Right, Force Palm. Boom, that's Lapras gone. I will have to switch out. I'm pretty sure he's going to bring Mama Swine back in so I can just go into Quagsire on the Surf and that should kill. So I did heal my Quagsire up. I'm open anyway. Please go into Mama Swine. Please. Yes. Okay, sweet. Uh, right, little hammy. Oh, there he is. The Mamos way. Superpower. That is a silly move to go for. That is not even gonna scratch. Well, I mean, it scratched. Definitely hurt, little hammy. A little. Oh, you have the white herb. Okay, okay, okay. I see you there. What good Pokemon would you have, though? I don't even know how many you have left. La, 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 la. It's a lot of XP. What do you have? What do you have? A Frost Lass. Going to master. See, I would have gone into my Luxray, but he's nearly dead. So I can't do that because he took that blizzard from the Dugong. He's still have two mons left. Rushless's cry is super eerie. Oh, you don't think well. Don't even think about killing my Charizard. I'm not even on full health. Nice. Good stuff, Charizard. That's why they call you the master. You're not the apprentice. You're the master. That's how. That's what the different stab makes. Mine was stabbed, so he killed that Frostlass. Frostlass Thunderbolt was not stabbed. We have Glalie as well. I'm just going to close combat with Skeeter. I'm going to come out and go... Just knock that Glalie out. It's going to be like a... Um, like a punch him back. And he's going to go... And just knock this Glalie out of the world really he's gone he's gonna be gone so it's combat time if this doesn't kill I lose my Lucario though but it should kill it nearly killed a Lapras it's a choice banded close combat there we go boom so that's good last two gyms didn't lose one Pokemon I'm happy with that I'm sure you guys are happy with that seems as if my luck has run out it has unfortunately I'm impressed by your prowess. With your strong will, I know you will overcome all life's obstacles. We're worthy of this badge. Hey, cheers, bruh. Appreciate it. That badge will raise the special stats of Pokemon. It also lets your Pokemon use Whirlpool to get across real Whirlpools. And this, this is a gift from me. The TM-07. Is it Ice Beam or Blizzard? It's a Blizzard, isn't it? The TM contains Hail. It summons a hailstorm that lasts for five turns. The hailstorm damages all types except ice. Incidentally, that was a good battle. In hope that we might face each other again, I'll give you my number. Alright. I'm collecting all the numbers anyway, bruh. Alright. Slide down here, slide down here, slide down here. Slide down here, slide down here. Bum, 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 bum. What's Elm ringing me? HDV, how are things going? I called because something weird is happening with the radio broadcast. They were talking about Team Rocket. HDV, you know anything about it? Maybe Team Rocket has returned. No, that just can't be true. Sorry to bug you. Take care. So that's it now with the Team Rocket bits now? Can I not go this way? Oh. Hi, Kira, see you now in my hand. I'll take a red candy bar. I'll take one. Right. Well, because I've not gotten any encounters this episode, I'm going to go do the encounters to the right of New Town. 
I've got my new Barking Town Encounter. So I used an old right at the very start of the playthrough. But I don't have them all the way on the right. I think I can go there as well. And because I'm not going to get an encounter because we've got to do the whole rocket thing. I'm going to do that right now. Um, so let's fly to New Bark Town. Boom. We're going to go right. So this is Route 27. So this is an encounter. I don't know what level is going to be. 33. Okay. Um, so I don't even know if it's going to... I'm just going to play it safe and just icy window with Sophie. Is she pursuing me? Nice. That's kind of funny. Uh, I think I can catch it from here, right? Was the likes box I chose? Okay, box 16. Yeah, okay, that's right. So we've got one encounter. Oh, I can't do this? Hey! Do you know what you just did? You're taking your first step into Kanto. Check your Poké Game map and see. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. Um, so we have Tojo Falls here. Uh, we have the water down there. It's got my Tojo Falls encounter. So many encounters here, it's crazy. How am I going to get through this? Right, this is my... So, bro, level 43. Oh, my lord. I would body summon you. Oh, my lord. This thing is not going to... Just slack off. Why have I not got one paralysis yet from Body Slam? Like, why? I would love a Slowbro. Slowbro is a really good Pokemon. I actually really like Slowbro. It's so bulky. Can you like start? How have you hit me with a Zen Headbutt every single time? I hit you with an Ancient Power. Ah! Oh my God! Where's the paralysis? Come on, bro! It's thirty percent. It's literally thirty percent. It's thirty percent. And I can't get one paralysis. Is there a reason behind that? I definitely... Like, he hasn't missed... I don't think I'm going to catch this. I have water absorb? Right, there's the paralysis. Oh my lord. Right, can you just please get in this ball, I beg? Yes! Thank you so much. That's level 43 as well. I can level that all the way up to, like, the rest of the team. Higher than some of my team, actually. Right, so that's root... This is... So it's still Route 27, so I still there still isn't an encounter yet. I don't know how many encounters there are over here. Still, this is not a new encounter. Still a weasel. Oh, I would have loved a little 40 back there. I have no idea where to go. Is that how far I can go? I just found a rare candy, so I can use that, and I'm going to use that right now. I just actually found one. Um, I'll just use that on... I don't know. Sophie, why not? When I find rare candies, I'm allowed to use them. So I think that's just the two encounters I can do here, right? For Tojo Falls. I can't even fly. Ugh. That sucks. So I don't have waterfall yet, so I can't go any further. Still got a few, a couple encounters. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. I love the fact that you can go from Johto and Kanto, though. I think it's so cool. Right, I can fly now, right? Why? Why you're doing this to me? Diddle 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 but we so but we so we got two encounters though, which is all good. Right, I can fly now, surely. Oh my lord, really? Right, I'm gonna go to Golden Run. So I've got all the encounters right. Actually. What I can do is get to Sea Wood. So I know I definitely have High Friendship now on one of my Pokemon. 100%. Like 100%. I must have High Friendship now on one of them. Surely. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, I got Game Oh, so we get the Surf Pikachu though. So that's awesome. Which is another encounter. I think that's all the ones I can get. Uh, so I'll do two encounters this episode, then I'll do one next episode. Um, because I, I want at least one that I can do next episode. Right. 
Let's go get a Surfing Pikachu. Finally, I can get this thing. Oh my lord, it's been so long. The amount of times I've spoke to this. Definitely the person I've spoke to the most in this whole playthrough. Yeah, I'll take it. Surfing Pikachu. Okay, bye. Have a great time. So what is this? It's level 26. It's such a random level. It's a female. A Surf, Fly, Wish, and Thunderbolt. That's so cool, man. I like those little kind of Easter eggs. All right. Go all the way down here. So we'll do two encounters now. But I have three in my party. Okay. Uh, we'll just do these two. I'll save. I'll save Surfing Pikachu for next episode. Right. Let's get the dice out, Aruni. So we're gonna do the red and the green dice this time. Seven. Seven, box seven. Okay, okay. Now we're just going to do the red dice. So three across and one down. TM26. I'm not really too bothered about that. Um, we'll do the red and the green dice again. Six, box number six. Uh, seven, box number six. Red dice now. Two across. And two down. I've already got that, so we'll do it again. Uh, five across. And two down. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I haven't got that one yet. Solver Solvernia. What's a cool name? Right, so let's do these encounters real quick. Let's do these encounters real quick. Let us do them real quick. Oh. Dupes, but I'm gonna keep it because I want a Garchomp so bad. <laughs> um, and to be fair, I could put that in for Lil Hammy as well. Having a Dragon type and Ground type, I might do that actually. I'm probably gonna do that. Um, let me name it something. We're gonna call it. What is it? It's male. Um, we're gonna call him. I'm gonna call him. I'm gonna call him Liam. No, we'll call him Power after Liam Power. We're gonna call him Power. Makes sense. So it's gonna be absolute power. Gotta make sure it's a shiny though. When I um, hack it in and stuff. Right, next egg. Boom. I wish they stayed shiny. It would have made my life so much easier. I don't know why they don't, but anyway. Here we go. It is A. Shiny roll, it says dupes. So do I have a God of War in my team? That sucks, because the shiny rolls would have been really cool, but I already do have one, it's just not shiny. Uh, we'll just do another box six one. Uh, I'll just grab this one. What was this rolls as well? That's pretty good. Timid as well. It's literally the exact same as the one I have, it's just um, shiny instead. What's this gonna be? Do I go with Chimchar? I've already had one in the past. But if it, no, I'll do one more. I'll do one more encounter. So I have already had. We had Jay at the very start of the playthrough. We had Jay, who got like Earthquake, Nature Power. All right, we'll go with this one now. Man, that's such good moves. All right, this one's gonna be it. We're getting so we've only had dupes hatching these eggs right now, and there's so many more Pokemon we could have, and we've only had dupes. That's just another gym jar. bro. I think that might have been from the same person. I have a feeling. So we're gonna not go to that box anymore. We'll go box five. We'll go down to the bottom corner, bro. If we hatch the same Pokemon three times in a row, surely not another Chimchar. Surely not. An Alekid. Yeah, that's a good encounter, man. I'll take an Alekid. Yes, I would like to. We're going to call you... Uh... I 
I have no idea. We got some good names though. Um, you know, we'll call him Aiden. Uh, Cause I remember the Stone family. He's just commented. I remember he wanted me to call one after Aiden. I think this is how you spell it. I don't know. I think that's how you spell it. Uh, I'm gonna feel really bad if I, I don't know if it's A I D E N or A I D A N. I think it's that. Aiden, if you're watching this, I know you're watching this. I think it's Aiden as well, right? Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Right. But I'll take an Electivire at some point, 100%. Right. So, I gotta put... So, you're gonna be shiny, but I'm gonna keep you in my team, actually. I'm gonna make you a Garchomp for next episode. Well, not Garchomp, but I'm gonna level you up. So, put Aiden there. Uh, box 16. So I still got another encounter. But I'm gonna make you a shiny anyway. Box 18. So that is gonna be everything for this episode, guys. If you did enjoy, please remember to leave a like down below. I really appreciate it. Really help out the series, channel, all that good stuff. Uh, remember to like if you have enjoyed. Comment every single time to make sure you're in a with a chance of having a Pokemon named after you. But yeah, that's everything for me, though, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Have an amazing rest of your day. And until next time, peace.